Welcome to my channel, Rated Arts at Rock. I am your girl, Hailey Zoom. I'm going to be on to my space. Please be aware there will be trigger moments. Everything will not resonate, so take what resonates and leave the rest for whoever else. And also, flip and switch the situation however it pertains to you and your life. He could be a she, she could be a he, and vice versa in other areas. If you're new, welcome. If you're returning, welcome back. What's up, Taurus? How y'all feeling this morning? I hope everyone is great. On this Monday morning, okay, it's a little dreary looking out here, but it's fine with me. I like it when it looks a little dark sometimes. What's the message for Taurus and love? What do they need to know and be aware of this person that's on their mind? What specifically is going on in Taurus life when it comes to the matter of the heart? So what's going on in Taurus for? What Taurus need to know when it comes to love? All right, Taurus, let's get it. Let's see what's popping out here this morning for y'all. Hope some good news. Oh, Lord. So you talking to a snake, Taurus? Or well, somebody's talking to a snake. <laughs> what does Taurus need to know about the person and the situation that they're in? A runner, okay? person's a runner. Well, people knew that. Fear of intimacy, running away from, and they codependent. This is why they run, because they codependent. We just talked about this. <clears throat> Somebody's cutting ties and moving on from something. Somebody's running from fear, intimacy, this and that. Third, yeah. Codependent, heartbreak, backstabbing, pain. What else for Taurus when it comes to love? What is this? Something changing here, Taurus. There's a change. There's a shift in the energy. Jeez, please. Mm. Now this person's into you. So I'm thinking the runner, this person runs to you when they, when it's intimacy time, when it gets too intense, when y'all get into an argument, whatever happens, this person always run. You could say the fucking wall is blue and they said it's pink. They're going to run. All right. This person's a codependent person. They codependent on people, places, things. And I feel like them being codependent and running, they backstab you here. But it's a change. It's a shift in the energy. This person's into you now. Yeah. No more spirit. <clears throat> yeah. Somebody's into you. They want to evolve. They want to grow. They want to go towards the next phase in their life. They're healing their inner child and they're releasing the past. This person wants this unconditional love from you. They want a higher level of commitment. <clears throat> you could have told this person something about self-worth. It's it like playing in their head. The runner. What we need to know about this runner. The tourist and love. What we need to know about the runner. That's codependent. Yeah. They run and they go and be with other options. They go deal with other people and one night stands and string you along. I feel like this person wants to set a date. I think this poor person enjoy being with you. <clears throat> My throat, y'all know. People be doing all them hexes and curses and shit. Um, they going through a breakup. And now they want this stability with you, Taurus. Yeah, so this person is a runner. They're in fear of intimacy. They run away from everything. And then they go to, you know, they many options. One night stand, stringing along. Codependent addictions. Addictions, Taurus. Yeah, this person is a narcissist. Yeah, he's codependent on his supplies. Yeah, well, we know that one. Shit. Yeah, this codependent ass narcissist, love bombing, self absorbed, one sided. This person could have backstabbed you. Backstabbing. What tourists need to know about the backstabbing here, spirit? 
you're going straight to that straight to the source this morning backstabbing yeah so this person could have got backstabbed from them running around here being codependent running to all these options feeling like they need to be codependent on other people's energy other people's pockets other people's lives it's because they're a narcissist they love buying people they all about their self they're very self-absorbed okay and i don't know if this is you or this person but somebody caused some type of heart back somebody backstabbed somebody and they're healing from this they want to rebuild this connection after <clears throat> After healing from all this hurt and toxicity and addictions and abusive relationships. So after they done with their healing, they're going to want to rebuild this connection after they sabotaged it. Mm -hmm. But the truth is, this person is still wearing a mask. What's this shock spirit? There's a change in energy. Now they interested in you. First they wanted to string you along. Other options. One night stands. Narcissist. Love bombing. Codependent. Runner. Backstabbing. Need time to heal. Now something's changed in the energy. Shock. What is this sudden change? They trying to manifest they damn. They trying to manifest they twin flame. They want this abundance with you. This person is learning their self-worth and they want this union with you. And they watching you too. Yeah, so it's a change in the energy because this person want to manifest with you now. Teddy bear. <coughs> Teddy bear. Interested in you. They want to party with you. They want to have fun. This person single now. They can come and be free. They want this stability with you. But I feel like you're still not probably dealing with this person. You could be still upset. Upset. You were giving this unconditional love to this person. Releasing the butterfly. What is the butterfly here, spirit? This person wants to party with you. They want you to come with them and meet up, go somewhere. A party, the butterfly. Yeah. Releasing the past and new growth, new phase, renew, change, rise from the ashes. Somebody could have separated from someone and because they were wearing a mask. <clears throat> you and somebody else is interested in talking to each other. But somebody's wearing a mask and they're not showing their hand that they just had an ending with something. That's why they want a new beginning. Cut ties and moved on and they're missing you. They cut ties with somebody. They want you, they want you Taurus. They see you as their soulmate and their partner. And they want this passion with you. They think about this chemistry. Mm -hmm. Let's do one more. One more. One more row. Key on the ring. Key on the ring. Jeez, amazing. Look, look. They chasing you now. What's this? Unconditional love return. They were dealing with these codependent energies and chasing them. They were running from you. Going to these codependent, going to these uh, many options, one night stands, chasing them. Because they're codependent on people for whatever the fuck they can do for them. They were giving unconditional love to this bitch right here. They were both giving affection to each other. But now this person is seeing that this person was just 
<laughs> hooking up and dating third parties they was tempted and i feel like now this person's ascending they were giving unconditional love to a girl with a snake in the past so yeah they were running from you going towards these many options chasing them giving them love giving these bitches that's check that's giving these people love that is just using them because they were in temptative energy but they ascended from this temptative energy they don't want to be tempted by this shit right here they want this unconditional love from you but this person could be lacking or the person that they were dealing with lacking confidence i don't know but they want unconditional love from you towards they haven't had enough they want this union with you. They want a higher level commitment. <clears throat> yeah, this is what they were doing in the past. They was chasing. They was chasing these many options. Addiction, codependency, the mirror. Why is the, the golden mirror here? Narcissist, love bombing, self-absorbed, one-sided. Why is this here for Taurus? What Taurus need to know? They ready to make healthier choices? From all of this love bombing and narcissist energy that they were chasing. Now they're ready to make happier choices. Now they're ready for this passion with you. They're in love with you. <laughs> they were indulging on the phone with you. You guys were enjoying the conversation towards backstab to needing time cycles and time to heal. So this person got backstabbed by somebody. Somebody fucked them over. And now they got to uh, heal from this shit. Clock. What they healing from? Meeting up with somebody. Clock. They want to meet up and talk with you. Yeah. So now that they healing. <clears throat> they want to meet up and talk. Savor the money moment. And build this friendship back together with you. After they've been backstabbed towards. Sudden change, abundance, and twin flame. What's this twin flame? They learned from the past. Now they want to come back to you. They reminiscing about you. All right. They want to mirror back. Self-reflecting on this passion between you two. Knowing their self-worth so they can have this higher level commitment. And giving silent treatment to someone that they were giving unconditional love to. Something ended and they're healing their heart from it. It was toxic. It was drama. They didn't want no more of it. <clears throat> so they separating themselves because they missing you. And they miss enjoying this moment with you. They miss this happiness that you bring them. Yeah. They could be in union with this girl with a snake. But now they want this stability and they're wearing a mask. So they hiding the fact that they want to be with you. And whatever they calling and talking to you about is the truth. They're expressing love to you. But you like coming to, you know, everything coming to light. Things is healing. This person wants you as their soulmate and they want to give unconditional love back. This snake here is missing you this person that kept you in competition they learning from the past that's why they trying to manifest you back what's this teddy bear and party they ready to have fun with you not to us <clears throat> yeah they ready to they send it from to the next level preparing for this union they want to be with you. Releasing the past. New phase. Rekindle. Rise from the ashes. Phoenix. Yeah. They want this happiness with you. They want to enjoy the, the moments with you. They want to talk to you. Y'all could be talking about how happy y'all used to be in the past or something. Tell me about this runner. What we need to know about this runner? 
We already know enough. <laughs> They're coming back to you. Wearing a mask. Why? Why you say wearing a mask, spirit? Oh, because they know. They not telling you. They could be hiding the fact that they feel it's unfinished business. It's a snake here. This snake could have ghosted you in the past. Tell me about this runner one more. You're their addiction. You're this person's addiction. They're wearing a mask. They know that it's, they, they don't want this to be over with you. Spirit said the truth is this person is still a player. And then they get drunk and go deal with third parties. This person's at a crossroads because they're in fear. They had a faded meeting with a snake, or this is you that's going to have a faded meeting with your snake. But they could have ghosted this person because they were dealing with legal matters. Now they want to text message you because they secretly crushing on you. Tell me about the chaser. The chaser. <clears throat> they could have go all do all this with their friends. Or well, this is why they put you in a friend zone. Like the chaser. Yeah. They were like friends with benefits with these people and they broke up with them. I feel like they feel like this they wanna be with you. What's this wedding have to do with tours? Yeah, they secretly crushing on you. That's why they wearing a mask. They wanna hook up. Codependent. The tours. Addictions. The tours. Addictions for tours. Addictions. This music could make this person think about you. Yeah, this music could make them think about this relationship and why they ghosted you. Healthier choices. This person is at home, single, acting unbothered. Because they thought that the grass is greener. Grass is green and where? The tours. They released and surrendered something. They thought that the grass was greener. Something's changing. This person's starting to notice that they're attracted to you. You're reading between the lines and watching the signs and synchronicities. They regret being a player. Now they're starting to show their romantic feelings towards you. They want to tell you the truth about their money and why they're stressing out. Coffee cup. Backstab. What happened here with this backstab? How this person get backstabbed to make them want to change? What happened here? Backstabbing. And divine timing, you're going to find out the truth that two cards fell. They in regret. Regret for what? What happened? They could have backstabbed you. Yeah, so this person caused you heartbreak. This person was in a toxic relationship with someone, and I feel like they had romantic feelings for you. Whoever this was probably was crushing on this player here. And now they at a crossroads because they want to <clears throat> come and ask you, do you want to be a part of their life again? This ex-lover of yours is healing. And they've spiritually awakened to the fact that you're their soulmate twin flame counterpart. They went towards a new love and that shit fell apart. Now they stressed and worried about their money. 
they gonna wanna hook up with you unexpectedly. You don't know this. Yeah, y'all gonna reconcile when y'all do. Y'all gonna have some fun. Y'all gonna party. All right. Meeting coffee cup. I don't know. This turned in reverse. Coffee cup. Save in a moment. They're going to want to meet up or they're healing from this. So whoever they were meeting up with, talking to, trying to build something with that backstabbed them, this person didn't change. I feel like when they went on a date with this person, they seen the warning sign. They could have went and this person could have been doing something disrespectful or something. Maybe the way they eat or chew at the dinner table. I don't know. But something didn't change here when they went on this date with this person. And they was meeting up, savoring the moment. But whoever this is that backstabbed them, warning signs. They seen the warning signs of this person. That they all about money. Something about finances. Unexpected. So... Somebody can get some money unexpectedly. And then they won't want to take you out to a party or something, Taurus. Somebody definitely want to party with you. But this is a storm warning. Somebody's emotional over some finances. And um, somebody's going to get an unexpected invitation to come out, hang out, party. What's this twin flame? But yeah, something didn't change here when they went on this day with this person. They seen the warning sign. Something about these finances was unexpected. So they could get some unexpected money. Or you tours. What's this uh, twin flame? <coughs> you tours. <coughs> they gonna get the liquid curse to wanna hook up with you. Hook up with the courage. They, yeah, they're going to travel to your ass. I don't know. This could be y'all talking on the phone. And this person, as they talk, you noticing that they ain't changed. And then when y'all go out, you're going to see it's the same shit. They want some finances or something. It's going to be like, damn, my bank account empty as hell. Ascending. Teddy bear. I don't know, they passed up a third party here. What we need to know about this third party situation. Third party. They starting to use their intuition to read between the lines. What's this teddy bear for Taurus? Interested in you. Yeah, they still got romantic feelings for you, Taurus. Interested in you. Look. <laughs> They see you as their soulmate. Spirit ain't played about that. They like, no, they into you tours. They gonna send you a text message. Y'all gonna meet up. This is fated to happen. Something about a family, a tower moment happening with the family here. Somebody healing from this snake. This could be you. All right, some snake shit that somebody done did. This ex-lover is awakening to this. They're starting to notice that this toxic relationship brought nothing but heartbreak. And now they're in fear and worry that they feel like they're seeing the signs and synchronicities that you got a new love. But really, you magnetically attracted to this player. Talking. <clears throat> they coming back for your ass, Tori. Talking. I really don't see nothing bad. Ex lover. So, yeah, this your ex lover that you're going to be talking to that had you in a toxic relationship. What's this heartbreak? Somebody going to be heartbroken through a text message. What's this toxic relationship got to do with Taurus? 
So I feel like they're going to talk to you and tell you about an ex-lover that they were in a toxic relationship with. They could have to deal with some legal matters because of this person. Yeah, because I said talking. So, yeah, they talking. They're going to be talking to you. They're going to they, they gonna make you happy. Okay? They want to rise this. They want to rise to the occasion in this relationship. Okay? They want to make you happy and talk to you. I feel like they're going to tell you about an ex-lover who they had was in a toxic relationship with. That's dealing with legal matters. <clears throat> this person is stressing in fear, Taurus. That you got a new love. They starting to feel it in their bones. Like Taurus got somebody else, man. Now look what's attracted. This player is magnetically attracted to you too. Somebody could have did something heartbreaking in a text message. Somebody could have sent this text message that broke somebody's heart. And it tore this family down. Alright. <clears throat> so I hear Taurus, I mean shit, your person on their way back. What's the uh what Taurus need to be aware of in this situation? Somebody's hiding something. What they hiding? What Taurus need to be aware of? They hiding the fact that they are magnetically attracted to you and they ain't never letting your ass the fuck go. What's the outcome of this situation for Taurus and their person? They want a family with you. Every time I ask the outcome, it always stay coming together. Yeah, this player going to text message you. Because they heartbroken and in fear. This caused some type of unexpected anxiety. Because they starting to see the synchronicities that you with somebody, Taurus. They nervous as hell, Taurus. They stressing out. They regret having this secret crush. Okay, they regret what you, they did to you by having this secret crush on the side. And the truth is, oh, everything gonna work out in divine timing. This person's at a crossroads and they want to reconcile with you towards your person is. I ain't got nothing bad to say about this morning. <laughs> I'm kind of losing my voice, y'all. Taurus, your person ready to come home, boot knockers. <laughs> Your person said, uh-uh. Uh-uh, Taurus, I'm coming home. I'll be at that door later on tonight. <laughs> Let's see the messages now. Because the last time the messages was like, I'm gone. I'm out. I'll let you later. What's the love messages here for Taurus from their person? The love boot. The love messages here for Taurus for their person. From their person. Um. Okay, let's see Torrey. What's the messages here for Taurus from their person? What they want them to know? They broken. I feel shattered about this situation. And I bet you you do. Cause I've been going off on your ass. Y'all should have let y'all person watch my video. <laughs> I feel like a part of me is missing without you. We still have things to resolve and discuss. I told you they ain't going nowhere. Holding back because of gossip. They was holding back from you because of what other people were saying. And now they're starting to notice the values in this connection and they can't stop thinking about you. This person felt unworthy. They feel like you can do better than them because they, they always miss the fucking boat. Mm. What else the message is here for Taurus? We don't hold Taurus the wrong day. Message for Taurus from that person. Oh, shit. I'm, I want to have equal give and take. Now, I told you they want to get an affection in return. Now, let's pull one. Let's pull a couple more. Shit. By lying, I ripped us apart. So, at least they noticed in their mistakes where they fucked up at. By lying, I ripped us apart. Is there anything else that this person want to say? I don't think they want to say nothing else. It's not nothing else here they want to say. I think I just did the whole deck all over again. 
there anything else towards person want to say i left when things got hard i think that's it i don't think it's really much too much because i'm going through this all day all right anything else they want to sell towards no towards that's it okay they feel shattered about this situation I feel like a part of me is missing. Yeah, this car is still dark the same way. Okay, they feel like it's unfinished business. They want to give equal give and take. They knew that they dishonestly tore up this relationship and they left when things got hard. Now, what is the outcome of this situation with Taurus and their brother? The message here. What does this person feel? What's the message here? <clears throat> they want to start a new chapter with you. There were other things that got in the way of us being together, but I'm starting, I'm, I'm trying to heal. See that third party? They knowing they self-worth now. They knowing they self, they gonna love they self. They feel guilty towards, for going back towards their past. I can't make this up. They can't let their past go. But wherever they went, they were not satisfied. And now they want to understand it with you. Because they full of regret because they were in their ego. They knew that this chemistry with you was something that they ain't never have. But they were struggling to find their way. They were struggling to find their destiny because they didn't know. They were stuck in trauma from their past and things like that. They know the damage that they do not only affects you. I mean, not only affects them, but it affects you too. Because they keep sabotaging this connection. But now they're starting to reflect on the things that they're doing while they're detached from you. Mm -hmm. Because guess what? <clears throat> they're trying to move on from all of this old bullshit so they can have this new chapter with you. They, they left. They ran when it got hard. They, they want to reciprocate this with you. Okay? They want to give equal give and take towards. They want to be more honest with you now. They know that they're lying, ripped this apart. They feel broken without you being there. They want a new chapter towards and they want, they, they feel like it's unfinished business. Taurus, your person is like, he must have heard my message. <laughs> All right, Taurus, that has been your reading. Until later, you guys, I hope you have a beautiful, productive day. I will holler at you later. Peace, Taurus.